is your welcome back to another video. Today, I have brought another keyboard. It's been hmm, a year and a half since I've gotten last keyboard, so I put it out. Yeah, I know, it looks disgusting. There's like ripped buttons everywhere. That was actually recent. There was only like two buttons ripped before this, but whatever. Um, this I got this from Five Below um, almost a year and a half ago, and it's really weird it's for traveling so it's like rollable and stuff so that's why i had it i went to new york um during december last year and i had that with me and it was pretty good but if you want to use it on a daily basis for like normal stuff and you're not going to travel with it i do not recommend this definitely not but it's my first keyboard so yeah and now i have this keyboard is actually ten dollars um, and some cents, uh, but whatever, doesn't matter. Ten dollars from Walmart. Um, it is called the Surf On USB keyboard. It has a lot of keys. It is quiet. It's pretty decently quiet. It's low profile and um, seems all right. It has all the keys on keyboard. Let's see. Let's look on the back. USB keyboard, built-in shortcuts for email, web browser, and media player. The basics, plug it in. We've got the key to a simple typing solution. Our USB keyboard has a low profile design and contoured keys for a natural typing experience. Connecting is easy, just plug the USB connector into one of the computer's handy USB ports and type away. Surf on. All right. And full size keyboard with number pad, low profile keys, and here are some specs. USB keyboard, five feet cable, full keyboard with all the keys, USB plug and play, PC and Mac compatible, LED for number lock, scroll lock, and caps lock, and then the dimensions. So, so I'm, I'm just gonna get right into it. Um, oh, another story actually. Um, while I was going to buy this, me and my mom were going, and I was like, you know what, I need a new keyboard. So we weren't looking. Um, we asked the guy where the keyboard were, and he said, uh, "Is it for gaming?" And I was like, "Yeah." He's like, "Put that away. We're gonna we're gonna look somewhere else." So he showed me some like Razer and some uh, Corsair keyboards and stuff like that, and I was like, eh, still need my second keyboard. I don't need like that crazy keyboard stuff. So that's why I went with this one, the cheapest one they had at Walmart. Ten dollars is a really good price for this. Alrighty, you got your thing, got a little wrap. It's uh, ooh, it's probably the cable. Yep, that is the cable. Put that out, put that away. All right, you got the cable, and you got the keyboard. So. He also got some paperwork right here on my keyboard. And uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's the box. It's not really that much. Alright, here is the keyboard. Okay, first thing out of the box, this, <laughs> it's, it's pretty thick, but hey, it's alright. It has, ooh, it has some stands. Ooh, it clay stands. Uh, let's pull those out. All right, see that? Uh, this is a test. This font on the keyboard actually reminds me of Product mm, Product Sans. Yeah, Google's font. That's what that reminds me of. So, yeah. caps lock, Windows Alt. Oh, I thought that was a control key. Nope, that's Alt. Control Alt, Shift, caps lock, and stuff. All your F4s and F5s and stuff. Alt F4. <laughs> Um, you got backspace, you got your lights, you got your on logo there engraved pretty much. And yeah, that's the keyboard. It's not a big deal, but hey, it's a pretty decent keyboard so far. Um, the design it is a bit big. I mean, obviously it's thicker, as you can see. But um, like at the top, I don't know why they have this big gap. I don't think you'd need that. But for $10, what am I going to say, right? Okay, uh, let me take off this. I'm gonna try this out with my computer and I'll say what how that works out. Okay, so you got a decently long cable. I don't know how to there. That's that's pretty much all the cable there. This one had I think a short it's short this ooh, that's all the keys gone. This cable I think it's actually shorter than the one I had before. So this one right here, the top one. Is the old keyboard? This is the new keyboard. I'll oh, see how long each one is. Yeah, the new one's about maybe six inches longer, half a feet longer. So, sorry. 
um, there was there is a wireless version, but you need uh, batteries for that, so I didn't get that. It would be a good deal too. Um, Five dollars extra for that one, if you, if you wanted to know. I don't think I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna probably be using this one for a while. I mean, this one's good. It's pretty much. What can I tell you? It's like decent. It's a bit high. I have my like, palm right here. It's a bit high. That's it. But this the the old one was really low. So, um. But yeah, that's it. And it was a uh, stuff. There, there's me. Okay, and stuff. I'm gonna read through this. There's a bunch of keyboard shortcuts right there. Volume up and down, mute, uh, next, previous, play pause, email, stuff like that, and whatnot. So that's cool. They actually have the indicators right underneath the indicators. They have the indicators right underneath the keys, if you see that. And so on all the way down. So, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna try this and I'll get back to you. So I've used this for about um, a day now and this is a pretty good keyboard. So this is a test. Uh, this keyboard is really good for just $10. That, I don't think that's where you put that. But you get the idea. So for $10, this keyboard is pretty good. It has LED light indicators, pretty much all the buttons of the world you'll ever need and has shortcuts for everything and <laughs> uh okay um anyway you get the idea so pretty good keyboard for just ten dollars i don't know if you'll get anything better than that or cheaper even because ten dollars is really cheap i don't even know if you'll find anything cheaper than this on amazon because i've tried and then you got to put shipping onto it so after that it becomes just expensive so for $10 and no shipping fee because you bought it from the store or I bought it from the store so this would be a pretty good keyboard for anyone if you want to buy a bunch for your school or something this is a pretty good keyboard if you want to buy this keyboard for like a friend or something on Christmas this is also a pretty good keyboard caps lock every, every button works so it makes sense so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed if you did like subscribe uh, make sure it's gray or Please make it great. Thanks. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Yeah.